All right, guys, welcome back to another Upper Omnia video where we are going to view the showcase vid for Aphmau's LD weapon. So, as always, if you do enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for future content. Let's check out exactly how she works based off of what we already know from the data miners over at the City of Compendium, which shout out once again to them for the uh, for the early information on Aphmau. So let's check this video out, then we'll kind of go through it and uh, see what we catch. Uh, that was a lot of damage. Also, their weapon skins are on right now, too. Alright, interesting. Now, there's one thing that I definitely want to see, and I want to see how she performs the, uh, how she reduces the amount of damage that the enemy does. But hopefully, they show that in this video. Yeah, it seems like the only thing that they're showing right now is just the, like, her turn shenanigans that she does. Not the HP damage reduction. Alright. So her animation doesn't really look like, like, crazy epic, like half of these, like, LD animations are. But... Let's uh let's let's review the showcase once again and kind of see what she does. So she's about to activate the LD, then she chooses the character. And if you don't know, basically what Aphmau's uh, LD ability does is that it makes it so that whoever she just chose, which in this case is Tifa, um, she. Aphmau basically makes it so that the EX recast speed of Tifa or any other character that you bring Aphmau with in the team, their EX recast rate like jumps up, like goes like really, really high. I like those, uh, <laughs> I like those gloves. But it doesn't look like, you know, like all of that, like it's not that crazy of an LD weapon. Uh, you know, it's not like anything fancy or anything like that. But as you saw, um, as you saw with the turn shenanigans, after Aphmau was done with her move, you can see Tifa jump up right in front of Guy. So that's like the other thing that that Aphmau does with her uh, with her LD weapon. And then of course, I I really wish they would have shown the enemy attack so that we can check out the whole HP damage reduction that she does. But I guess, uh, I guess the only way to, to pretty much test that out is, uh, with a, I guess me trying to get her LD hopefully and then making a video out of it. And then of course, Aphmau does bring, you know, the party buffs and everything like that, which I will review... Uh, once again, uh, once we are done rewatching this, and so you guys can know exactly like what her LD does in terms of like like percentages and stuff like that. So actually, let me let's exit out of this. Let me set it up super quickly so that I can because a uh, Rem from the City of DB has uh, done us the uh, a bit of a. It, she, he basically made it so that it's a little bit more understandable instead of like what I read off of the City of Compendium, which of course was already updated after the video release. Um, but this will make things a little bit easier. Let me just change this to the score. Uh, no, that's not right. Let's see here. Uh, oh, here we go. All right. 
So pretty much, hopefully you are able to see it. But basically what her LD does is that the Brave Damage Del goes up by 40% while the party has at least six buffs. The party-wide effects while her LD buff is active is Stolen Brave Overflow Limit goes up by 20%. The Gained Brave Overflow Limit also goes up by 20%. The HP damage taken gets reduced by 30%. And... Alphmal's LD also provides a Brave regen, which restores Brave based off 30% of the max Brave. And also, you do get, as long as there are 6 or more buffs, an HP damage increase of 10%. So, I mean, it's not a bad LD. I mean, what really catches my attention, and I, and I talked about this on my initial video on Alphmal, was this right here, the HP damage uh, being reduced by 30% and that's why I I'm hoping that I can pull her LD tomorrow morning so that that way when I do have the chance or maybe I, I might just live stream it too just to test it out uh, we can kind of see how much damage exactly she will reduce on like say a boss that automatically attacks me we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out I'll, I'll figure it out if I uh, if I if I decide to do a video if not you know if I'm if I'm live streaming I will uh I will test uh, this thing out. And then, of course, the other ability which makes it so that uh, she basically has, like, turn shenanigans to any other character and, you know, so on and so forth. So, but overall, though, I mean, it's not, like, the most fanciest of fancy LD weapons like we have been seeing so far. I mean, you know, it, it, it is very basic. It's not, like, really all that. But, I mean, what she is providing already is actually not... It's actually not that bad, but let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about Aphmau's LD, the showcase, and everything like that, and uh, if you are if you are pulling or not. So, anyways, that's gonna be it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I will catch you guys in my next video.